Well, we're at Asprey's, um, New Bond Street, and we're going to show the Diamond Queen, which is the latest in my series of Queen portraits. In fact, it's the defining portrait. Chris Levine, the uh, brilliant light artist, approached us uh, to work with him on creating the diadem part of his portrait in real materials, so platinum and diamonds. I was commissioned in 2004 to do the portrait, and ever since then it's been something of a work in progress. I mean, over two sittings I shot a lot of material. In a way, the opportunity at this point in time with the Jubilee was a time to really kind of draw a line under that work and produce what I, I believe to be the defining work. Well, I think it's really quite emotional. I think it just sets the Queen in her diamond anniversary year as this iconic presence. And I think adding the diamonds really just makes it even more powerful. It's setting it in stone. The portrait will be displayed here in Asprey's store from May the 28th through to June the 26th. And then after that, it will be at Masterpiece between the 26th of June and the 5th of July. You, you can't photograph it. As soon as you photograph it, it kind of just chops a dimension out of it. It's, it's really about the experience. And to see that, come, come to New Bond Street. There are over a thousand white diamonds in the piece, uh, 15 different sizes, each plate placed and handset individually. The pearls are individually screwed onto a piece of platinum and then riveted into the piece. And the final stone to go in is a fantastic yellow, intense, fancy diamond in the centre, and this was riveted on as a last process. Luckily, we house our craftsmen here, so we've been able to undertake the work all in house, and it carries this year's Jubilee Walmart. Well, as a light artist, you know, diamonds are a very efficient optical device. But a combination of diamonds and light, you know, as, a, as an art form, has, has a, a lot of potential. And for me, really, it was to do something that would celebrate the portraits. It's had a, a phenomenal amount of positivity around the world with this work. And really, to channel that positivity into, into two very good causes. We're selling the piece through um, sealed bids. All the proceeds will go towards the two uh, charities, Quest and the Woodland Trust. Asprey is over 200 years old. It's one of Britain's oldest luxury brands and over the years has been fortunate enough to enjoy the patronage of the royal family. So given this is such an important year, uh, we felt that we really needed to do something very unique and very special to celebrate Her Majesty's 60th year on the throne.